Some people like to look at the goblet as, as half empty. Me, I like to look at it as half full. We've gone from the bottom to the top, ladies. But we're not just an empire. We're a family. Oh. Everyone's got your cupcake, cupcake, cupcake. Good, yes, Baba, good. Oh yeah, you know, we have put away a lot of ogres. And so one got away. <laughs> Who cares? It's not a big deal. Doesn't matter to me. It's not like it's the end of the world. <laughs> Except, funny thing. Now that I think about it, the ogre who got away is Shrek. And if he shares a kiss with Fiona by sunrise, well, it, it is the end of the world. Our world, my empire! <laughs> <sighs> but, as I was saying, I like to look at the goblet as half full. <laughs> Yelling makes me so parched. Anyone care for some water? What you whistle? A clear, crisp, delicious glass of aqua purificada. Anybody's thirsty? Nobody's thirsty? No? Well then, does anyone care to tell me what's going to take to get this ogre? You! Faster brooms? No! Pointier hats? No! You! Maybe we could hire a professional bounty hunter? No! <gasps> what a world! What a world! Hmm. You know, actually, not a bad idea. Baba! I need a bounty hunter. And if music doth soothe the savage beast, <laughs> then I think I might know just the person. Listen up, everyone. Word has come from far, far away. Stillskin is leading tonight's ogre hunt himself. What? He's never what? Done that before. Why? Shut up. I admit that's because of us. Shh. Shut up. You fucking crazy? We know, we know. That's what everybody says. Cut the shit. If that cupcake-eating clown finally leaves the safety of his filthy witch nest, he'll be vulnerable. The plan's simple. If they follow the usual patrol route, they'll reach the river by midnight. We'll be concealed along this road, waiting for his caravan. Once they reach the clearing, I'll give the signal. And then we attack. And when the smoke clears... Wait, what's this? That's my chimichanga stand. Um, no, Cookie. We won't be needing that. Trust me, Fiona. Y'all are gonna be really hungry after this ambush, okay? Now go and finish your little speech. All right. As I was saying, when the smoke clears, Rumpelstiltskin is gone and the chimichangas have been eaten. Far, far away, we'll finally be free. And so will we. Spread the word. We move out as soon as Rumpel leaves the palace. Man, this is serious! Tell me about it. How am I ever gonna get her to kiss me before sunrise? Uh, actually, I was talking about the revolution. Revolution? <laughs> Why don't you just tell her what you told me? You know about how you're her true love and you came from an alternate universe. Oh, well, while I'm at it, why didn't I tell her that you're married to a fire-breathing dragon and you have little mutant donkey dragon babies? I do? You saw what happened. She's gonna think I'm crazy. I'm a daddy? You know what? If I got Fiona to kiss me once, then I can do it again. <laughs>